Welcome back to Game Devs Play Games, where you can watch games practice game design. We're back with Okami. Wait a minute. I was supposed to. No, it's an no? even number. Oh, oh, whoops. Yeah, no, it's my turn. Oh, well, whatever. Mm. That's fine. <laughs> back at it with Okami, and we just got into a cutscene. I mean, we're sort of in cutscene paradise right now. Yes, we are. Huh. There's no barrier this time. That Orochi must think no one would dare come in here. It's Probably. down. Be oh, my God. What? Said, it's down because you have who he thinks is, uh, I forget her right. name. We should still be careful no matter how unprepared that snake is. is it Nami? Nami, yeah, who, the selected maiden. Yeah, I mean, if you think about it, you managed to slay Orochi 100 years ago, but you died too, and you were at your peak back then. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna die. <laughs> you're not gonna die because Let you're gonna go back to the future. Get it, see, it all makes sense now. Yeah. Legend I mean, probably. says you appeared each year around the time of the sacrifice. Back then, you were called Shiranui, but were, but were said to be a monster. So how come you didn't just go get rid of Orochi right away? Well, I suppose you had your reasons. But I bet it made Orochi think you were a big fat chicken. So that is interesting, though. I wonder if... Maybe uh -oh. there was like a point where Amaterasu or Shir Shiranui actually was evil and something happened to where Shiranui turned into Amaterasu, hmm. you know? Interesting. Huh? Where am I? Well, while I'm here, I might as well kick. Oh my God, I'm wearing women's clothes. <laughs> Oh, God. It got me good. Oh, oh, jeez. Why am I wearing this? Hey, Pops. You finally came, too. Now you can pretend to be the human sacrifice and slay Orochi. Then Nami will fall for you big time. What are you talking about? I thought you were far away from your mic. Oh, I'm good. Don't oh, you worry. yes, of course. Ha <laughs> ha. Because I'm a hero. I am Nagi, the greatest warrior who ever lived. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh fuck. What's that? A giant seven-headed snake monster. Peace out, guys. Uh, dragon, Eddie? Please? Uh, the correct term is dragoon. A, d a dra goon <laughs> Brace yourself, Amy. Here it comes. How nice would it be if we don't have to go through the whole dungeon and we just get to fight Orochi right away? That'd be great. No such luck. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Actually, I have no idea. I don't uh, remember. That's, oh, oh, oh. Spit back out. <laughs> Disgusting. Disgusting. That's a guy. Wow. Ew. Well, didn't fool Orochi, but hey, now we're on the other side of the barrier. Yep. Looks like Orochi can taste the difference between man and maiden. Well, well, this is it, Amy. Psych yourself up. We're about to face Orochi in peak condition. Psych yourself up. Oh, psych yourself up. Anyway, mm -hmm. sorry. Actually, we I don't think we do have to go through the dungeon. Oh, wait. Okay. Nice. Okay, cool. Good. So we do, I mean, like, I guess at this point, maybe Orochi doesn't have the dungeon. It's just like Orochi hangs out on a platform. <laughs> and he's like, oh, gosh, you know what? That was really annoying when that dog came in here last time. I'm gonna build a dungeon. <laughs> well, that that I think last time didn't wasn't the whole like stairway destroyed, something like that. So like it clearly had existed prior. Yeah. Oh, that's the sake. Oh, look, Amy, the sake barrel. Ooh, sweet. Da -da -da -da. You obtained eight purification sake. Good. Too bad Orochi <clears throat> didn't drink it down when he tried to eat pops. But I guess things are never that easy. Still, it ain't over till it's over. <laughs> I mean, victory is still up for grabs, ain't it? Yep. Here we go. Come on. You ready for this? Come on. We haven't fought Orochi since the the, uh, the halfway time. point, right? Yeah. I couldn't remember if there were like a lot of mini Orochi fights. Good old times. You should you Whoa. should hit that checkpoint. Skaboom. Thank Skaboom. you, Eddie. Thank you. 
for your service to this country. You're welcome. Huh. It's golden, too. It wasn't golden last time. Well, this was Orochi in his prime, man. That's yeah, true. Hey, isn't that... Uh... Okay. okay. Oh, that's right. He went in ahead of us. Uh... Oh. An evil power lured me to this cave. Oh. It all makes sense now. Interest. It never was, Nagi. Ah. <laughs> Hot damn. And now that you're also here, there can be no doubt. It wasn't the sword that he took? Maybe blue? this is the sword. But Nagi had that sword. Oh, maybe. I mean, maybe hmm. they just like, maybe Nagi will land the final blow, kind of like what Suzano did. Okay, yeah. This must be Orochi's stronghold. But Orochi was alive when he took the sword, because he came after him. Or the spear. The spirit unleashed. The well, spirit right. got they, unleashed when he took the sword and it attacked Oro him. Orochi's a okay. demon. They sealed him away. Yes, he didn't they actually sealed, die. That's what I, yeah, I forgot. They sealed him away. Anyway, sorry, I'm just trying to remember what the hell is going on. <laughs> it has been a while, to be fair. <laughs> We're, what, 98 episodes in? That happened maybe, what, episode 40? I was right. <laughs> Huh? Amy. You were right about, uh, oh, 111 uh, uh, episodes? Yep, it's going to happen. It might. Amy, there's someone passed out over there. Oh, no. It's Lika. <laughs> it's all come together. Huh. Interesting. Oh, has he claimed Lika as just like a bonus maiden? Hmm, have we ever seen Lika? We've not seen her. Oh, there she is. <laughs> all right. It's like a leaf. She's that. She looks like a leaf. Oh, God. Last time was it, um... Kushi? Oh, did did he did Orochi have Kushi before? Yep. Yeah, it was Kushi. So this is the So this is the dreaded Orochi. Sorry. Amy, this time's the real deal. Really? Remember, you just barely managed to slay Orochi at your peak. And in the end, you died too. Fools, how dare you stand in my way? I shall claim my hundredth sacrifice and become the god of the underworld. <laughs> then I shall bring eternal darkness upon the land. But first, you shall pay for drink defiling my dark sanctuary. I'm sure. I'm a stranger to these lands. Your words mean nothing to me. Now Kutune shall feast on your blood. That should be more than enough to fulfill its need. Yeah. Oh, man. This is cool. No, Oki, wait. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. Lika, Lika's on Orochi's back. It's still going to be fine. I oh. care not. Maybe it won't be fine. <laughs> <laughs> For Orochi will be my ultimate offering to the sacred, sacred sword. The sacred sword. Thick sword. I don't know why I said that. Kutone will devour the beast down to the very marrow in its bones. Yeah, I don't know about that. Mm. Hey! I mean, like, to him it makes sense, right? Because one person sh doesn't stand in the way of him saving everyone. Right, the sake is pouring into whatever that is. This is bad. The this... sake is not even ready yet. No, this is the same thing that happened last time. Oh, right, because you use the... It's a very. I forgot. It's very compressed in there. I'm. Uh, I'm impressed. Uh, right. I forgot. I think. Uh, don't they have to like open their mouths or something? Oh, he's just straight up stunned. Well, you can just attack him. Nope. And then he like. Yeah, there, there you go. There yeah, just like last time. It's really not so bad. No, no, you got him. You see, he's drinking it. He's swallowing. He's like. <laughs> So really, you just gotta, yeah, yeah. There you go. That that, that smoke trail is definitely following you. Yeah. Those are lasers. It also didn't hurt me. There you go. By the way. Oh really? Yeah. Oh wow. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why. I'm not gonna like. I'm you. not gonna like try my luck with the rest of them. <laughs> just saying. Come Let's on. Are, are you you lost, buddy? Was he having a hard time? Oh, there, wait, wait, uh, 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 there he goes. Do 
Boink. Missed. Oh. Well. Right, well, I mean, it's fine. <laughs> I think, yeah, maybe you just attack him. <laughs> oh, what the oh, hell? Oh, yeah, that worked. All right. <laughs> nice. I actually thought it wasn't going to do it. You know, this time around, the fight hasn't changed at all. This is pretty much is the exactly, exact same thing. Yeah, so if you it, didn't uh, watch the earlier episode, like, this is literally part two. But, uh, it, in a way, kind of feels easier. Right? Like, not necessarily in a bad way, either. It's just like, yeah, we know this. But you know, like, we're, we're not, like, figuring this out the hard way at yeah. this point. Should it be easier since this is the second time we've done this? Like, do they really want to make us go through the entire fight the same way again? It, it really With depends, this, right? I yeah. mean, like, there's a right and a wrong way to do that. Sure, uh, yeah. The wrong way is the Skyward Sword way. Okay. Uh, <laughs> no. Where they, Don't you know, reuse nice. the same goddamn boss battle every single time. Um, <clears throat> that me. And, like, they made it difficult just by, like, switching up some minor components to the fight. Right. There you go. Um... And it just wasn't compelling. Yeah. Uh, so if if they, like, added a bunch of health to Orochi and, like, didn't change much other than, like, maybe a couple of behavior things or add, like, one extra wave to it, uh -huh. it's still redundant. It, like, that one extra wave of different attacks isn't enough to, like, make for an interesting experience. Okay, so now... Now you just... No, you climb. You want to go find the, the way oh up. Oh, my God. There's, there's one that will... Oh, that should work. Yeah. And then you ring the bell, oh, right? Oh, no, it doesn't let me do it. It has to be from that side. Oh, maybe not. There you go. Hit that shit. Ding, 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 ding. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Uh, you probably should get out of there. <laughs> but uh, that didn't do much damage to him. <clears throat> it didn't, right? Maybe I should have slashed it. Oh, maybe that is what you were supposed to do. Uh, it's that part I definitely don't remember as well. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you might have. Too far. Oh, uh, yeah, oh well. This fight's oh. definitely still a little tedious. Yeah. Oh. Hey, oh. You didn't, you didn't get him. You didn't slash him. That's okay. What are you doing? I think you can still kill the heads, though, can't you? Because they each have health, or do you not deplete any of their health? Um, I don't think I deplete any of their health. Mm. Also, I remember you don't have to. Do, you only have to do three of these. Yes. Do 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 do. <clears throat> and then you. Come on. You chose the one that's the most difficult for you. This requires blooming. <laughs> if you don't bloom those pods, they'll curse you. Oh. But there were two there, so... Boom. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. That's <laughs> <laughs> alright. Yeah, it's Get drunk. Yeah, I don't remember if it's just, like, three heads total, or if it's, like, just the amount of times you get... you feed alcohol to heads in general. It's two, it's it, two there, times be three heads. Seven, so ten, ten times you'd have defeated alcohol. Unless it's twice. Like one head times. each. Oh, no, yes. Just, oh. just three heads. Huh. Yeah. Well, that's pretty easy. Yeah. Okay, so now we have decided that it would be a slash. Oh, yeah. That's, that's the moneymaker. Dang. Wow. Uh, <laughs> you might be able to just finish this wave. I have four. I. Oh, okay. I don't know where I got one from. There you go. One more. One more. Nice. Boom. Dude, Jam. nice. Sweet. I have free no uh, uh, roaches. Fuck that a roach. <laughs> okay, right. now is the point now. where we actually kill the heads. Yeah. Which, oh. this is my favorite part, because it's like, you're slowly... This, exactly. like, feels more like you're actually killing. Yeah. Or making progress. There you go. Just wail on him, man. Well, I guess you do have unlimited. Yep. Yeah, that's that's fair. You're, you're making good choices right now. 
<laughs> damn. Oh, damn. You ain't nothing, Orochi. Ain't nothing. Sploosh. Dead. Oh, I missed that one to get him drunk, though. Oh, man. Womp womp. I missed my opportunity to get him drunk. Darn it. I forgot that it rained out fireballs. Well, his does. This guy's does. Or no, the whole thing does. That's yeah, right. because the whole thing's in fire now. Not bad. Did I just... <laughs> froze everything. I froze no, I, I think, I think. I got him, cool. Oh, did you freeze only the one guy? Uh, no, I froze them all. Ow. But it gave me time to make sure that I got, ouch, the, um, that I actually did. Ah, uh, I gotcha. Yeah. That Infinity Stone lasts a Ow. long time. It lasts a very long time. Damn, that's way better than I thought it was. Yeah. I thought it'd be like a 10 second, like, Mario Star kind of deal. Right? I've already killed, like, two heads. Well, and... Killed the bell. Yep. Hot damn. Hot damn. This is pretty good. We're already at time, but we'll keep going no, because. Keep going. Yeah. Fun. This is one of those end game fights. Well, is it though? I don't know this game. <laughs> You'll find out. Do you remember? Yep. I've alluded to it a little bit. You're out of infinity. I'm gonna stop right there. Well, wail on him with your whip, man. You can kill him the normal way. That's right. I actually <laughs> did not. I actually did not think about that. I thought since I. I know that's why I said something. <laughs> that was weird. All right, I don't want to talk about that. I'm sorry. I landed in well, that fire. We didn't kill the other head. This one. Yeah. Well, I guess I'll just do this. First. You're already most of the way there. Oh, uh, you could have gotten the other head thrown. Mm -mm. It's fine. Oh, oh, laser! Oh. oh, laser throwing me off my game. Yeah, I feel like I don't have much else interesting to talk about with this. I mean, we just gotta, you know, get through this. So. Yeah, I guess maybe like, if you, and maybe we'll make this the question of the day also. Um, but if you had the chance to nice to switch up the Orochi fight, like say say. You were like, okay, wave two, we're going to change it entirely. We're going to make it a whole new thing. Mm -hmm. What would you do? Wait, is that the question of the day you're asking me? I mean, both, really. We'll talk about it because we're still in the episode. Um, I mean, since this is kind of a time traveling thing, I don't know how much how much different I'd make it. I'd still make sure that the sake thing is, uh, is part of it, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I definitely agree. And and I think that them establishing that, um, you know, this is how Orochi was beaten in the past. Yeah. And then when we fought him the first time, it was basically us mirroring that. Yeah. Um, switching it up actually would be a disservice to the design of this. Uh, yeah. um, because then it would mean that the way he was beaten in the past was not even close to the way he was beaten uh, in, in, in legend, yeah. I guess. Yeah. Um, that said, though, like, they could do something that maybe incorporated sealing him away a little bit more. Right. Because when we beat Orochi... Oh, um, yes! Yeah. Nice. So when we beat Orochi the first time, uh -huh. um, there was no component of sealing Orochi. He basically died and then flew away. Yeah. Um, so this would be an appropriate time to say, like, okay, maybe um, instead of doing the you know, the part where you're kind of taking down the bell. Yeah. Maybe you're like breaking his tether to, you know, the mortal plane or something. Mm -hmm. And then you do a similar process once you break that, where you're, you know, slowly sealing away each of the heads. Mm -hmm. And then you do some final sequence with uh, Nagi, where he, you know, seals away the final head or something like that. Kind of. With the same type of format, just with a different context and maybe some different types of challenges. Yeah. Um, but, you know. Um, did Orochi not? I mean, he doesn't have like a... Well, he's just been a dragon, right? As far as I understand. Yeah, he doesn't have like a human form or anything. I don't think so. Yeah, that's probably not, that's probably not a thing in this, in this lore. There's some lore out there, some stories that dragons have human form. I mean, I, I think that wouldn't necessarily be uncommon in, like, Japanese lore. Yeah, that's why I asked. I think you need I to, like, hit him. 
You see, whenever he's like, where do you go though? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, there you go. But like, if you had a human form, it'd be cool to fight that. And then, like... That would definitely be interesting. <laughs> <clears throat> I almost wonder if, like. But then, you... how large would the stage be? Like, you know, the, the one disappointing thing about this fight so far is that there is literally no involvement with Oki. Oh my gosh, there's, there isn't any. And it's like, well, why did... I, I assume he's going to show up during, like, Wave 3 or something, and maybe he'll fill the void that Nagi would have done. Um, yeah. I, I, that's my assumption. But I almost feel like there should be some component of, like, simultaneously fighting Oki so that he doesn't kill uh, yeah. uh, uh, Lika. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Might help if you get close. That's all right. Um, <clears throat> I am bummed that he's not even in here doing anything. I know. It isn't, doesn't like, it kind of feel weird? It does. I understand why Susano wasn't in it, because he wasn't there yet, right? Well, Susano, that, that's what happened, right? Susano was there. He just is useless. Okay. Um, oh, so wait. No, that's right. It he, was part, he was more part of the fight. He was just useless. Well, he wasn't actually doing anything, um, but narratively speaking, he was just kind of like hanging by while you were doing stuff until he felt he had a moment to strike. Or maybe he did show up at the last moment. I don't quite remember. And maybe that's what Nagi will do also. Well, we you know? did something with him at the last moment. This is on. We did. And, and maybe that actually was the point where he just like showed up. Yeah. Um, um, <clears throat> but yeah. I, but, but, but Oki's here and Oki's powerful. He's not a useless piece. Yeah. They made a big deal about him being yeah, here. And he's not doing anything. And that's not good. And they, well, they also set it up for him to kind of be like um, an obstacle, mm -hmm. and he's not. Yeah. So yeah, I don't know. It, it's just it seems like an, an odd choice. I up. And I assumed the reason was just because to the devs it may not have been worth the work. Yeah. Or you know, it would have been too much work to just like incorporate something new into a a pre like scripted fight um, and who knows right like they had to make it work work with the narrative but didn't have the budget to actually yeah. incorporate it more um, and to be fair I think most of the time players aren't really going to care like not everyone's going to play Final Fantasy 15 and decide to not fight the boss and realize that nothing happens if you don't choose any actions right not everyone playing Okami um, is gonna be like, well, where's where's Oki? They're gonna fight Orochi, and then Oki will show up oh. when the time is right for the narrative. Yeah, and then they'll be like, oh, wow, that was really cool. And that's no no knock on on the average player. I'm just saying like, if if the devs identify that most players don't really care that much, mm -hmm. they're not gonna spend their time, you know, making s a bunch of totally new content just for something that people are indifferent about. Right. Right there. Slash them like three times. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> You're getting close, man. This is much easier than the first time. Well, yeah, because we have better weapons and we know what to do and all that jazz. There's two of them there. Oh, you got them both. All right. What you got in my circles now, Chris? Pick up that ink. Oh, you missed it. Oh, I didn't. You did. But you did miss it. <laughs> I'm just saying. Whoa. Whoa. Nailed it. It's, a, it's quite a... It's extravagant. Trajectory of sake. I should have done this guy first. Ow. Jeez. Yeah, I agree. There are definitely some that are more of a pain in the ass than others. Yeah. That's not bad. Yeah. There's probably a way where you can kind of like hover enough on one side so you don't aggro the other. Yeah. Yeah, pick up that ink. Yes, I did. I literally got it. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Now you got it. Come on, bud. I got it. Just, just, Stop. Try, just try to play your support role right now, Eddie. I think you really need the help as you wag <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, ow. Alright, all right. oh, missed me, mother. 
Okay, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna start wrapping up this episode. I think okay. we should save the the final sequence for not? the next episode. Yeah, it didn't look like it worked. So in the next episode, we're gonna wrap up this sequence. We're gonna kill these last two heads. We're okay. gonna do the final sequence with Nagi slash Oki. Um, question of the day is, how would you redesign this Orochi battle part two to differ from the original uh, without sacrificing the the narrative context? I think that yeah. that one's actually kind of tough. I, I don't think there's a lot of really clear answers answers to do that. Right. Um, but I think that's a good 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 thing to, to practice. Oh, screw you. <laughs> <laughs> that was bullshit. <laughs> he got in the way, and so I aggroed him. You could probably just slash him right now and kill him. No, he's not going to die. Do it. It doesn't work. Well, you yeah, never know. You can only hit him when he's drooling. Not always. And not maybe. Womp womp. All right, well, anyway, we'll see you in the next episode. All right, bye. Bye.